everyone and welcome to my packing video. This is what I typically pack to go for a seven day stay at my mum's or a friend's house in London. Normally for the travel I'll be wearing this thick jumper so I've always got something warmer to wear. I'll also be taking either my coat or my jacket depending on how warm it is. I'll also be wearing my scarf and a belt. My shoes I'd be wearing my Converse to travel in and I'll also put my wellies in the car if we went out walking with the dogs. Normally I'd also be wearing a pair of jeans or if I wanted some more flexibility with my outfits I'd take a skirt and tights which I'd then have the option of wearing out if we went out for a meal somewhere. So without further ado let's get started. Typically I take with me my on your backpack. It's made of recycled plastic and folds down very small. I take two bras with me including also the one I'm wearing. I take six pairs of knickers with me. I've only got five pictures because one are in the watch currently. One polo neck sleeveless top. One plain black tank top. My three quarter length baggy t shirt. My grey long sleeve t shirt. It's very thin and light, but it's also nice and warm. My black billabong t shirt. A plain white cami. This camel colour jumper, normally I wear either one of my two camisole t shirts. Normally I take two pairs of thicker walking socks, two pairs of fluffy socks and two pairs of thin socks. I'd also normally be wearing one pair of thin socks as well, so it's seven pairs. Two pairs of jeans. Normally I'd be wearing one pair to travel in or I'd also wear a skirt and tights. I almost always have room at the top, which means I can put in my phone charger, my deodorant, a hairpin and a hair tie, my makeup bag, and often I can get in my razor, toothbrush, and sometimes even my laptop. And that's everything. So that's it. I hope you'll enjoy my video. If you liked it, please hit the like button and subscribe below. For those of you that are interested, I use the KonMari folding method, which you can see in the pictures. If you want more information, just Google it or look on YouTube. There's lots of tutorials out there. Thanks. Bye.